Hey everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with another reading, which is going to be a bonus love read. This reading is going to be for the sign of Aquarius. Topic of the reading is, will they come back to you? If you are dealing with a situation where you and your person have uh, parted ways, and you really want to know, will they ever come back to you or not? This reading will definitely help you know that. I will be adding some uh, message cards from your person as well in this read, so stay tuned and... Uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with everyone out there, so always pick the signs and messages that resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my mail ID. In the description box, you can also check out other services that I offer as well. So let's see, will they come back to you, yes or no? Whoever it is that you are, you know, in separation with and you really wonder, will they come back to you? Will they ever reach out to you? Will they wish to be back with you or not? Let's find out. Six of Pentacles, Six of Wands, they definitely will. They definitely will get back with you. The Divine is definitely going to bring the two of you back together. Um, I feel like, you know, they, they are going to come back towards you with some, um, some um, gifts to offer as well. I feel like, you know, there is some sort of regret that this person might be feeling right now for leaving you behind. And that's going to be the reason why they will be coming up front about their feelings, emotions, and not going to make you feel good about um, about yourself, uh, going to make you feel good, and um, in a way where they're going to, you know, it's a small like, you know, um, um, they, they would try to make up for what they did wrong, basically, with, the, with giving you some gifts, with giving you extra time, with spending some extra time with you, they are going to try their best to win your heart all over again. So I feel like, you know, they will be definitely getting back with you. They will be definitely coming back towards you. Um, they will make amends for what they did wrong. They will change themselves. They will make up for what they did wrong to you. Um, no matter what they chose over you, no matter what, what made them leave you, I feel like, the, yes, they will be definitely coming back towards you. And this time around, they will be coming in with a lot of presence for you as well. They are going to value you a lot. They are going to appreciate you a lot. They are going to feel like, you know, no, you are somebody special to them. So they would be having a lot of worth and value towards you, towards the connection that they have with you. And they would be coming back towards you as well. I feel like, you know, for the majority of you, this, this whole situation might take time to happen. Um, maybe from, you know, for some of you, maybe you are going to take six months to six years time uh, before it can happen uh, where the two of you get back together for some of you you might be like you know moving on to another connection moving on getting married to another person and then you are going to get back together that could also happen for some of you for others of you you might just get back get back together and uh, you know uh, you know this person is going to act as if nothing you know bad happened between the two of you so they would they would try to fix things up from where it ended so it's, it's going to be more of that situation um, I feel like you know for those of you who are you know already uh, you know, have been on the waiting side for this reconciliation to take place. I feel like, you know, you are very close to have that reconciliation. If it was a recent ending that you've had, maybe you will uh, you will have to wait a little longer. But for majority of you, I feel like, you know, six months to six years time is what I can see here coming up for you before you could have a reconciliation with this person. Um, but yes, I feel like, you know, the, the both of you are destined to come back together. No matter what happened, no matter how it happened, you and this person will be definitely getting back together. Um, and I feel like, you know, you're going to value each other more than ever, uh, you know, as, as uh, you know, uh, as this is going to, you know, this is meant to happen for majority of you. Let's see more cards here. Uh, the Hierophant. Nine of Wands. The magician for some of you you might be manifesting the situation with this person where you where you are going to manifest this person to return back to you not just that you are going to make them do whatever you always wanted them to do for you so i feel like you know this person is going to be coming in as a provider as well for some of you this person might add a lot of abundance to your life financial and emotional abundance too um i feel like you know uh, when this person returns back to you, I do see you having the upper hand in the situation because for some reasons, this person would feel like, you know, as if they did something wrong to you. So they would always try to kind of, you know, please you more than you are going to please them. I feel like, you know, it's going to be more of that kind of situation. Um, I do see that, you know, uh, currently, this person might be trying to figure things out for themselves to 
how to approach you, how to get back with you, how to reach out to you. So they, they might be already trying to decide their, you know, their mind about it, how to approach this connection now. For some of you, this person could be traveling towards you as well. Maybe they are going, they are right now staying away from where you live. Only the deck we do have the Ace of Souls. I feel like, you know, the understanding, the clarity that yes, you are the one for them is, is definitely taking place for them right now as well. Um, they are understanding the connection better. They are like, you know, going through that phase where they can see that uh, who they have lost and what can be done in the given situation is what they are thinking right now. For some of you, this person could be manifesting you and um, if you have been trying to move on, maybe this is the reason why you could not move on from this person because this person in, you know has been trying to manifest you in their life. So I feel like you know eventually you and this person is definitely going to come back together but at the same time, I really see that this, this connection that you have with them is uh something uh where where uh you know your person um um you know they, they they have some sort of regret which is the reason why they are going to put extra effort so maybe they were the one who left you for something else for, for another person maybe but yes they want you back and they would want you so badly that they would do anything to make things work this time around so even if they have to travel towards you leaving the other things behind they will be doing that as well so let's see some um, messages from your person let's see what you have to add to the read let's see so we do have hold on we do have, I remember the day we met, like it was yesterday. So this person has all the memories from the past that you've had with each other. Then we have the card, I want to marry you. So this person really wants to marry you now. Um, no matter what has happened, this person really wants to get back with you. They really want to get married to you. They really want to be having a future with you. Let's see some oracle cards around this connection that you have with this person. Let's see what the divine has to add to the read for you and this connection that you have with this person let's see what are the things that you need to do what are the things that you need to work towards to have what you desire with this person <clears throat> So we do have the end of a tough cycle approaches for some of you could be dealing with the capricorn as well um I feel like, you know, uh, the cycle that you have been having with this person is about to end where, you know, maybe you were in separation, detachment, an ending that was going on. And I feel like, you know, this person really is coming forward with a reconciliation to offer. It's time to release negativity. For some of you, you could be dealing with a Scorpio as well or another water sign as well. The divine really wants you to let go of the negativity that you still have around this co uh, connection, this person. And uh, the divine really wants you to uh, leave the past behind and start anew when this person reaches out to you and approaches as you uh, then we do have meditate and contemplate for some of you could be dealing with the Pisces as well um, I feel like you know uh, you also need to meditate and contemplate about certain things that you might have been doing in the past with this connection and with this person you got to heal yourself from the past and um, make sure that you know when you come back together you always make new memories without letting the past influence your current situation with this person so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this week if it was of help to like share and subscribe and yeah till i do the next read for you guys take care and bye